Austin ISD heads into the next school year facing a budget deficit in the tens of millions of dollars and this comes after the district made cuts to positions and contracts. Now tonight the board is voting on the budget. KXN's education reporter Nabil Ramadna shows us what the district is proposing to help cut that deficit down. Trying to do a lot with a little, Austin ISD discussed their 2024 to 2025 budget. Without, and I will say without, an increase in funding for public education, without an increase to the basic allotment, uh, not only will you see additional uh, reductions for Austin ISD that will impact the classroom, but you will see that statewide. Austin ISD wants to avoid that. CFO Ed Ramos has been crunching the numbers. So the deficit that we uh, will be proposing, again, will be $41 million. Uh, that is assuming uh, that the board does move forward with a voter authorized tax rate election. How would that impact taxpayers? Well, if you're a homeowner with a home that's worth about $560,000. That would be a monthly uh, average increase in taxes of about $35 if the voters do approve that. Uh, if voters do not approve it, the district deficit could be even larger. Then we would be looking at a $78 million shortfall. That would also mean no increased compensation for teachers and staff. We have identified $29 million in cuts, and so those have been made. Already, the district has made cuts to central staff positions, contracts, and software. Ramos says if AISD doesn't receive more state funding soon, they could be in even bigger trouble down the road. It's put us in a, in a tough position as, as a district. Uh, we have uh, limited dollars that we have to work with, but we still have to provide a service to our students. Nabil Ramadna, KXAN News.